by First Avenue. It's the 25th anniversary of Billy's Live Bait. Billy's Live Bait is our major label debut that came out in 1991. 90. 90? 25 years, yeah. Do the math. Oh, all right. <laughs> Not so good at math. <laughs> 1994 was the last time we played here. As far as I'm concerned, this is just an excuse to play first half yeah, again, exactly. really. No one were playing on a stage that my absolute idols have played on. It's huge for me. Back when we were playing here, Americana wasn't a genre yet, so we kind of quit a little too early to ride the Americana wave. Yeah, it's a hybrid. A little country, a little rock. It's not country rock, but it's no, kind of rock and country. Yeah. It's sort of the bastard, you know, sons of Johnny Cash and Sticks. That's <laughs> pretty, that's, yeah. Well put. Yeah. One of the things about this band is we were in the right place at the right time. Being in Minneapolis at the time, it's like, had the replacements, Soul Simon, Husker Du, and well, obviously Prince, and every label was sending people to Minneapolis, like basically getting a Minneapolis band. Also having Chrissy Dunlop, who booked First Avenue at that time, being a friend and a supporter was huge. Support is great. Our fans have been just relentlessly generous, you know, to come out and see us and support us for so many years. So it's it's awesome. We are definitely the soundtrack for a lot of people's college years. Yeah. And so these days, I look out at the crowd and I realize that we're keeping a lot of babysitters employed for the night. <laughs> <laughs> Where I've changed is not today, not today.